This is a short tutorial to show you how to print your colour management test target using the, Ad the Adobe Colour Management Print Utility. Now any uh, edition of Photoshop CS5 and above needs this uh, utility. Now what you do is to get hold of this page uh, from this uh, little uh, URL which we are, we won't be able to read it but we'll put it up underneath the video so you can click on it and it will go straight to it. It's an Adobe document and a little bit further down the document you'll see your download link for Mac operating systems and your download link for Windows operating systems. They operate very similar so let's 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 click on one, that's the Mac OS, and we're downloading the uh, colour print utility. There it is, it's just appeared on the desktop now. We'll get that out of the way, and we simply uh, uh, click on our Adobe colour print utility. So we'll just open that up, and what it'll do for us, it exposes this little dialog box here. Now we have our, uh, our uh, um, colour management uh, file, our TC 9.18 test target, and we make sure it's a TIFF, and we put it onto the desktop. So we'll go down here, and let's have a look, let's, there we are, so that's the desktop that we'll click on, and then we'll go here, and we're looking for the TC 9.18 test target, let's open this up a little bit, TC 9.18 test target, there we are, TC 9.18 RGB ISIS.TIFF uh, and we'll just click on that and up it comes. So this is the Adobe Colour Print Utility in action now. We open this up and all we need to do is go up the top here, we go File Page setup. Now I've got connected to this computer uh, an Epson R3000. So we have Epson R3000. We're going to print on some glossy paper A4, uh, portrait, and very important here: the scale has to be 100%. If it's if it's scaled, we won't be able to read it at this end. We then go to File, Print. And we print out the test target now using our um, settings, print settings. Now this is very important that we apply the correct print settings. And if you have any worry about what print setting to apply, you can always contact us via email or phone. And we'll tell you what the appropriate print settings are for your particular paper. In this case we're printing out on Marat uh, Profoto Glossy. So we use Epson Premium Glossy and we use the photo setting and for this particular case we'll have high speed off. Now we'll make a careful note of these settings and we'll, we'll mark those up so that when we, get the, when we get the profile back we'll apply the profile in Photoshop and we'll mimic these settings. Epson Premium Glossy Photo 1440 High Speed Off. What we do in this case is we'll just save it as a, as a preset. So save as, and here we go, we'll just put, uh, because it's, it's glossy paper, gloss, and we'll put Marit ink, because that's the ink that we're using, and the fact it's an Epson R3000. And we'll save that only for this printer, click OK. And what we can do now is just print. So we click on print and that'll do the job. Thanks very much for watching.